purpose of that is to make sure that uh, we have a safe environment in Hong Kong to protect the national security. And, you know, uh, um, if the violence or all the mayhem continues to carry on, we will lose the safe environment. And nobody will be willing to invest in Hong Kong in the long run. So um, I, I, if you look at even Macau, they have done their national security legislation and foreign investment continue to invest there. Uh, it's just to make sure that we have a safe environment. Now, um, if people have concerns about uh, this national security law, I, I, would, I would say uh, now the details of the national security law remains to be seen. But once we have the details, I'm sure that the central government will come out and explain to everyone. But uh, what I should say is given the uh, chaotic environment in Hong Kong, given all these violent protests and those terrorist acts happening in the past year, I believe that a lot of people, uh, a lot of people are expecting the central government to enact this national security law to crack down those uh, violent behavior. This is to make sure the safety of Hong Kong people.